He's smoking a Cuban cigar. <laughs> no, he's not. Right, so this is Cuba Paris. Um, you've probably heard about this, you've probably seen this. Uh, I've I bought this a few years back. Um, at the time I bought it, the first time I bought it, it reminded me of Jean Paul Gaultier, Le Mans. And even when I wore it, people thought that's what I was wearing. Um, it was very similar. Uh, I, I, and I've always loved it. I've always loved this smell. This is the second time I, I've purchased this. This is some um, optimizer, it's all attached. And let's just um, spray it. It smells beautiful. It's an absolutely beautiful smell. You can get this for about six pounds, between six and 12, depending on where you get it from. But I think, excuse me, I think I got this um, in a few months of having this now. I think I got it off Amazon uh, or eBay, one of them. Um, I remember having this, not having it, I remember smelling this for the first time. My brother, had had it in his car years ago. I must have been about eight or nine years old. And um, he had it, and I remember just being in the car and thinking, oh, whatever that fragrance is, it smells really nice. And years later, found it, and I was like, yeah, I'm gonna buy that. And yeah, I still like it up to this day. Uh, I think it's a really, really pleasant smell. Now, I said it smells a bit like John Paul Gaultier, that could be debatable. Uh, it doesn't, I don't know, I can't really smell the similarities anymore as much as I did back then. So maybe they changed the formula a bit. I don't know. Um, I can still smell it, you know, it still smells the same and not, not as much as it used to. What I would say is that the longevity on this isn't the best. Um, and I guess that's probably why it's the price that it is. You're not gonna be getting more than like four hours out of this. What I would say about this, this is an in-car fragrance. What I mean by that is something you put in the glove compartment, you know. This is a quick top-up, you know, it's a top-up. It's not like a exclusive one or something like that. Projection, average, average projection. Um, you probably have to spray a few times. And like I said, what, six quid? Just the, in terms of like, the projection and in terms of the longevity, you can't really complain for that price. I mean, you're not expecting anything good for six pounds. You're not, which you shouldn't be anyway. So <clears throat> that's why I thought this was quite incredible. Um, and you know, it's 80 mil, you get quite a lot. You can get them smaller. Um, so yeah, like I'm just gonna go over the notes. I haven't even got over the notes yet, my apologies. So the main of course are lavender, woody, aromatic, Vanilla, fresh, spicy, white floral, citrus, earthy, amber, and sweet. And the actual top notes are pink pepper and grapefruit. The middle notes are lavender and vivitaire. And the base notes are vanilla, amber, and tonka leaf. So you've got some good notes in there, and you know, it's going to give you a good scent. And that's what you get. You get a pleasant, nice, masculine, good scent with this. It's just, it's not going to last that long. That's all I can really say about it. But, you know, they've got different flavors, um, different fragrances, different you know, scents um, from this from this company, uh, Cuba Paris. So, you know, check them out. I'll leave a link in the description. And uh, yeah, you can see the different, you know, pa packages that they've got. But this one here was the one I remember having and I've always liked it. So yeah, check that one out.